Many high school students forego college level math classes because they don't think they can be successful, putting them at a disadvantage in college. In tonight's Education Matters, Juanita Stevenson reports that with the help of a $4 million federal grant, an organization is working to bridge the math gap through dual enrollment. Students in Prescott's math class get a lot of support. The Tranquility High School teacher says he provides opportunities both in and outside the classroom. Within the classroom, making sure that they know that it's okay to make a mistake, that they can try something and mess up, and then grow from that. Um, outside the classroom, um, we're doing things like taking students to Fresno State's Math Field Day. Despite this teacher's hard work, there are many students at Tranquility that aren't meeting state standards in math, and that could make success in college more difficult. My intention, my intention is that that uh, we really bridge the K, the 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 uh, high school college gap. District Superintendent Martin Macias is hoping to do that by bringing instructors from West Hills Community College onto the campus with the dual enrollment program called College Bridge. College Bridge is an organization that was formed to literally bridge the gaps between high school and college. So the program and the project that we're bringing to the Central Valley right now is called the Math Bridge Project. The Math Bridge Project aims to introduce students to college courses using the subject many of them dislike. The students it's aimed for are the students that hear the term college math and they go, uh, no thank you, <laughs> I do not want to participate in that. College Bridge officials are meeting with high schools that want to show their students they can do rigorous coursework. It provides our students and our staff uh, at the high school uh, with, with the opportunity to be able to work with West Hills College uh, professors to really bridge that math uh, gap that maybe we might have. Six rural community college in the Central Valley are participating in Math Bridge. All are members of the Central Valley Higher Education Consortium, which is assisting with the program. A lot of our students don't in the rural communities don't have the opportunity to take these college classes because they don't have a community college close to them. So by bringing dual enrollment to the high school campus, uh, these students are able to take college classes in their regular day-to-day -day high school. Showing students they can do rigorous coursework will help them not only learn, but aspire to achieve more than they thought they could. So if we're able to uh, uh build that self-esteem and, and have these positive experiences um, with these students, then maybe they, they'll consider going into mathematics. For Education Matters, I'm Juanita Stevenson, KC24, local news that matters. And one final note here, registration still open for high schools that want to participate in the program.